What is up guys, welcome to the final episode of this series. I'm your host Sparkman and I'm doing this uh, how to create a game with zero budget. So today we're going to create a simple boss for for your game. Alright, so I think we should have some scrolling. Let's um, let's do that. Uh, this will be the final platform here. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Maybe we can have some sort of G develop contest. Make like five levels in a boss. The winner could take a prize. Yeah, let me know down in the comments below if you like the idea. Okay, so there is our um, our block there. Hey, why is that like that? It's like it's not filling out. Um, is it 32 by 32 set of grid? It is 32 by 32. So what the hell? A game over area. So if you um, fall here, you get to restart. We're going to need something that gets destroyed. Maybe you just skip past the um, the boss and make it past the boss. We don't even have a boss right now. We're going to create one in a second. So we need an object here, so if you touch it, uh, the bridge is going to collapse, okay? Time. It doesn't need to be anything fancy, you can probably make something a lot better. I'm just going to um, uh, draw anything. Okay. Save it. Apply this. There is our dinosaur, okay? And, um, oh, I think I forgot something there. Okay, for the purpose of this example, we're not going to bother with animation with this. I think it's just fine like that. Let me try it out. See what it looks like. Just imagine like music playing. We can make this. Um, we can use this here. Delete object. I think it's called new object three. I believe. Let me just try it out. Should label that. Press X. And that works fine. And uh, we are going to add a behavior. Make him a platform character. So, uh, the next step will be to... It doesn't need to be anything fancy. Uh, there we go. Not the best looking hammer ever, but... It's a hammer. We made it too big, but that's okay. No big deal. So if we touch this, we're going to uh, delete this here. Okay, he doesn't move right now. Oh, wait, wait. We have to disable his uh, movement. Default control is disabled. Okay. And uh, we need scrolling too, so that's all right. We'll just add a new one. New action: uh, center the camera based on an object, which will be hitbox. Anticipate the movement by default. Yes. Okay, that's a nice little feature it has. So let me see if that works. You can see that it works right away. You can walk up to this, jump, and he dies. Wah, wah, wah. So simple. So if we get hit by the boss, uh, obviously we have to respawn. Then we, then we get to respawn. See if that works. So now there is no way we're getting past there because he cannot jump that high. So we need this guy to move. You can make it more complex if you wanted to. For this, I am going to make it extremely simple. It's gonna be called uh, DD for dinosaur. Okay, that's its variable. And um, the variable is going to be from uh, Dino King, and his variable is called DD. We want to add one to it. The variable reaches a certain value. Uh, Dino King DD equals say i don't know like we can make our character jump for dino king okay we also want to reset that variable okay we, we can probably set it to random okay but um we are going to do it time like this for now ah. okay I don't think that's enough time to get under under um it's gonna be very difficult to do that. Uh let me just uh, change his um jump. Set it to like uh I don't know like seven fifty or something. See if that works. 
Oh, he hits the ceiling. <laughs> That's going to be a problem. That's much better. Oh, crap. Ah, I don't know if it's impossible or not. Um, shouldn't be impossible. Ah, I think it's too sensitive. Okay, maybe we can have some sort of hot spot for him. Put an object around a uh, position. Okay, um, distance zero. That should work. I should drag the box with him. And it does. Now you can refine the shape of this box. I mean, I think you can. Remember, this is a pixel perfect. Okay. Make sure you can just run under. And that works fine. So now we just need to make this invisible. So there you go. Okay. And he dies. Wah, wah, wah. We also should make that invisible too. What is that called again? I like that because it, it's kind of like lava or something. So, um, yeah, I think I'm going to keep that there. And we're going to place our spine point right here. There you go. That is our ending. Okay guys, so that concludes our series. How to create a game on zero budget. So that was a simple boss, maybe you can improve it a little bit. Maybe you can make him move back and forth or something. Okay guys, don't forget uh, GDevelop is free and you are allowed to sell your games. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye now.